Hi, in this tutorial, I'll talk about how to add Solar APIs to your Maven project and AEM. Solar APIs already provide all the high level functionalities to you. You just need to call their methods, means the Solar API methods and perform your operation. So as part of this tutorial, we'll see how you can uh, add those APIs or the Maven dependencies to your Maven project and how you install those in your AEM. So those APIs are available as part of AEM dependency as we use AEM Maven project. So we'll see how to add that. So there's two APIs, right? Two, basically two Maven dependencies you have to add in your AEM project. One is Apache, ORG Apache service mixed dot bundles. Now one is this solar hyphen solar j another one zookeeper so please keep in mind you have these versions working right now once you use this and once you create your project or once you follow this tutorial please make sure you use the proper versions at that time so you do not need to do anything because these are already bundles which are available in maven repository you just need to add it to your aim project and you are done so we'll see how you can add that so I have a demo project called AEM integration. This is created with latest Maven archetype. So you have to create, you have to add those depend, dependencies, entries at three places. One is your POM, parent POM. So we'll add that, okay? So I have added those dependencies, two dependencies, version you can check it when you use it. Another one is your core POM. Go to the core POM and add those. So if I add it here, obviously in core, we do not need to add versions. This will take from the parent form. All right. So as soon as you add this, as soon as you add this, your code start compiling or you can use the methods of your solar APIs. So at that time, but when you deploy this code, your AEM should also have those dependencies in AEM. So either you can install it manually to the command of uh, the system console or you can add in project as a dependency and you can embed those so when you deploy this code those dependencies will also deploy so for that you go to the or module all okay either in all the new maven archetype projects you have this module or based on your project based on your project you would be having some module by which you deploy those codes right jar so you can add in your folder specifically as per your project but this is the simple project if you create maven you'll get this structure so i'll add this in this aem all module as well so what i'll do i have to make two entries of it one is in embed okay another one is in the dependencies in the bottom so what i'll do i'll make entries in this embedded sections this section for both dep uh, both maven dependencies okay so i have added you will see one entry for one jar so this is same group id artifact id and filter filter is true and i'm saying the target where i want to install this in crxd you will see the folders in crxd where do you want to install it you can choose folder so i'm choosing all where my all other jars are available for this project okay so both will be added here so using this this will embed those jars okay embed those jars with your package and install in AEM but you have to make a dependency also in it so we'll make a dependency add here okay so I have added this so before I build it let's go to AEM and check whether we have already have those dependencies or not so if I'll go to Firefox and let me refresh this, you will see this my system console. I don't have those zookeeper and another one is. Yes. So let me deploy this now. So either you can open your command prompt or terminal or you can run these in IDs as well. All the IDs has terminal. So I'm open in my terminal. So what I'll do MVN clean install okay hyphen P and the profile which profile you want to deploy. So there is a profile available here if you see here auto install single package right if you open this all pom so you'll find this either you can use this or you can install uh, auto install package both works so let me do this if i install it now run this command i'll leave this command in your uh, description or this is available in your pom file as well okay so build is done and let's see whether those uploaded or not means these should be uploaded these api should be uploaded means this bundle should be uploaded in your aem 
please keep in mind if those version doesn't work for you right let's say right now what the version i told you while creating this tutorial maybe those version doesn't work for you so go to the maven repository get the versions i mean don't get the latest one one version below what is the current version is and use this somehow sometime those version maybe not work for you when you use this tutorial okay so let me go back and see even if you see here the path i gave vendor you will see this installed solar 8.1.1 because i changed 8.7 did not work for me so i just changed this version right so and it worked even if i go here and refresh so you'll see these bundles have been installed both make sure your project bundle does not I means this core should be all the this dependency should be available nothing should read here so if you'll find anything read here and so this will not active you will see a, another sign installed and maybe your these bundles are not available these ones so you will see the missing dependency so all your dependencies should be available so that way you can include again one more thing i ran this command right auto install single package it's not mandatory you can use your regular command auto install package that's it you can run this as well your regular command both works both work the only difference is single package package all your packages in one package and then install this command install the package one by one that's the only difference so i hope you understood add your dependencies in your project so that those are available in your aem otherwise you will be able to write code here but those api won't be available in aem and your code won't work there if you have any question please add your comment